า
Emily, can you help us count to five? One, two, three, four, and five dinosaurs. Six! It's getting difficult. Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, and six dinosaurs. Seven! Let's check if there are seven dinosaurs. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven dinosaurs. It's true, there are seven dinosaurs. Eight. There are more and more dinosaurs. Let's count to see if there really are eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven and eight. Nine! Woo! I'm not sure if I can count to nine. Could you help me, kids? Great! Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Nine dinosaurs. And now, do you know what number comes after nine? Exactly! Ten! There are 10 dinosaurs here. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. This is wonderful. I love dinosaurs. Come on, kids. We are going to count to 10. Granny, please give us a helping hand. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. We've done it. Thank you very much, Granny. And now, let's play with the numbers. How many mermaids? Do you see here? There are four mermaids. One, two, three, and four mermaids. How many unicorns do you see? There are two unicorns. That's it. One and two. And now, even harder! How many Martians do you see? Incredible! How did you know that? Yes! There are seven Martians! One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven! Count things at home to remember the lesson. How many crayons do you have in your case? How many wheels does your bike have? There are so many things to count. Show everyone how well you've learned the numbers. See you next time. Bye-bye, kids.
Is anyone there? Oh, hi, Granny! Wow, that looks great! What is it? Um, what's going on? That is madness! Oh, I get it! How cool! It's an animalarium of dinosaurs in which much of them appear. You know that they lived millions of years ago. We have to form the different dinosaurs. <laughs> it's super fun! And of course, we're going to rebuild the Stegosaurus! Whoops! Looks like this is broken, Granny! <laughs> it's happening again, Granny! And what a strange result! It's the Steroratops! A rare mix between Stegosaurus, Pterodactyl and Triceratops! Only sighted in this animalarium! <laughs> Let's find its body and legs! Did you know that scientists believe that many dinosaurs actually had their bodies covered with feathers? Interesting! There's the body of the Stegosaurus! As you can see, Stegosaurus have triangular plates on their spines. It is said that they use these plates to defend themselves. Let's find the tail! Beautiful specimen of Stegoratops, Stegosaurus, and Triceratops. It could work as a character in a scary movie, don't you think? <laughs> Although I don't think the Stegosaurus would look very good with those legs. Let's keep looking. Hmm, I think someone missed a T-Rex tail around here. <laughs> Next. This candidate flies. See? Its legs are floating above the ground. This isn't what we're looking for either. Although, I'm sure the Stegosaurus would love to fly. This tail seems to be a better fit. Shall we go over it? It has sturdy, grounded legs. And most importantly, it also has plates on its spine. Is it the tail of the Stegosaurus? Yay! There we have our cute and beautiful Stegosaurus. It is a beauty! Do you want to take a picture? <laughs> hey! What happened here, Granny? The Stegosaurus has to be rebuilt! This is a Tyrocitops! Tricocetal! Asteratorex! Tegocetops! Tyrasorex! Trironodactyl! Sterodactyltops! Tegocetil! Tyrobosaurus! Sterextil! I don't even know what I'm saying! Oh, Granny! What if we ask the children what's happening? Do you know what happened, kids? Is someone changing the panels? I don't think Granny heard you. Let's say it louder. It's Wookie! What are you thinking about, Granny? Where are you going? Aha! She got you!